what that means. Time Hold to this. Bring out the bag. Hold this. Oh. Hold this. That's a Put that down. That's a real one. We're gonna lose him in a second. Got him in the yeah. throat. <laughs> Here. Hit him. Don't hit him in the hard plate. Hit him right behind the head. Okay. Don't move. Come here. Come to me. Yeah. Hit him right there. Yeah, yeah. I think it's a mutton. It's acting weird. What are we having for dinner tonight, yo? Mine. What's up, everybody? Blue Gabe. Y'all have heard of the food chain fishing challenge? Y'all ain't never seen one like this. I'm gonna go over here. You gotta watch my video I uploaded yesterday, Mutton Catch, Clean, and Cook, to see the other side. We're cleaning this side, and then we're gonna take this mutton and catch the biggest thing you've ever seen caught. All right, so we're gonna clean this fish. Brad, we're here at G3 Outfitters house. He's gonna take this and eat it with his family tonight, but we're gonna take this head and catch the biggest thing that you've ever seen on the fish food chain fishing challenge right here, right now. All right, so that's obviously the edible flay. This is what we're using next. We'll see y'all in the water. All right, y'all, we just started. We just saw a big gator. Vicky's up, we got my mutton. This is the food chain fishing challenge. For those of y'all might think it's fake, but see them scales falling off? That's him, that's the mutton you can watch me catch on my, on my first video I did this week. I'm also gonna show you on this video, but we gotta be quiet and put this bait out and catch this big gator. All right, give it a little bit of gas and get up there so the skater pops up and you don't see us. All right, so when you're putting these baits out, you gotta be super quiet. These gators can hear, these gators can smell. So we're gonna pull up in these cattails. Everybody's gonna be quiet. I'm not gonna talk to the camera. I'm not gonna talk to anything. We're gonna catch this monster gator on a mutton head. All right, so for those of y'all who didn't think he'd eat that mutton head, guess what? 400 yards that away, there's a giant. On the line, Vicky's gonna reel him in. We're gonna catch him and kill him. And I guarantee you, you haven't seen this on YouTube yet. He's just sitting there. Let's go get him. What do you guys think this is? Nine, 10 footer? No, this joker's 11 foot. 11? We don't kill babies on this vessel. It's gonna be my biggest gator. Woo! How excited? Scale one to ten. I am um, an eleven. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Yeah, that's that was eleven good. footer, right? Yeah, you can go ahead and start driving too. <laughs> so when I busted out that mutton head, I'm sure some of y'all are like, "Yeah, right. He's not about to do that." Vicky walked up. Zach, my favorite person in the world, walked up and was like, "What are you gonna do with that mutton head?" I said, "We're about to catch a giant." Can you record gator. that one more time. I said, "He's one of my favorite people." <laughs> what y'all don't <laughs> look, look, on YouTube on YouTube world? What y'all don't realize is my channel got messed up at the beginning and had something wrong with it. I didn't even hardly know Zach. I called him at what 11:30 at night. He oh, stayed on the phone until 2:30 in the morning, helping me get my channel right. And he didn't quit until he got it done. He didn't owe me a dollar. Didn't even really know me. That's what true friends do. He did the same thing with me. He helped me out. Get him on. That's my bud. <laughs> All right. But look right in front of the boat. Look at him right there, swimming right away from us. That's him. Oh, he that. don't even know he's on the line yet. Yeah. I wanted him to just think he's swimming around and there's a boat following him. That we don't. I don't want him to think we have him. In a minute, we're gonna put the heat on him though. You think he swallowed it yet? Yeah, I think he did swallow it. I'm not 100% sure because he didn't pick his head up very high, but I think he did. Back up, he's straight under the boat. All right, y'all, so when they get right under the boat, I have have her drag set on light. That rod's not going to break. We're going to hook him with this. I'm then going to take that rod and let her fight it with this. <laughs> Big old trips, three-eyed shrimps, boy. You want me to do? pull him up? Just start slowly. So I want her to do, when you're fighting a gator, it's not like a fish, it's steadily digging. This gator's probably 350, 400 pounds. 
and he's laying on the bottom. He's actually got his claws dug in the bottom. So when you go to pull on him, a fish, you'll pull up and reel down. This one, you got to pull up, reel while you're... <laughs> I just felt something right there. You got to be reeling when you pull up and reel when you go down because every time you pull up and you let him go, he's going to sink. Dead weight. He is heavy. <clears throat> Holy moly. I like this camera. How, how long is a leader? Eight? Four or five. I didn't know, but it gets really shallow right here. He's just right on the edge of it. No problem. Do that again, Vicky. This guy is strong. <laughs> you got some meat on the end of that stick, girl. <laughs> how about the bass that just hit? That was Shamu right there. Oh! We're all about to zoom it to the bass. I just bumped him. His body's laying right there. Let me just hold him. Oh here. no, I want you to keep pulling. I can't! Oh god, oh god, oh, he's, he's upset. Break, huh? no. Now he's moving. So now we know which way he's facing. Here it is, here it is. He's swimming under the boat. This gator is tough. Who would have ever thought? Hope we get him. I really want to see him. Like, I'm putting a lot of heat on him right now. Here he comes. All right, I got him coming. Glad you're doing this part, because I... Come on, Colton. Get ready, get ready. He's going to come up and get him. Oh, there he is. <laughs> he needs a breath of air really yeah, bad. Yeah, bad. He's about to drown. So he's, he's not on the bottom. He's just swimming out. He's going straight to the mouth. Can we cut him off? Yeah. Jake, that thing's 11 feet <laughs> all day. <laughs> All I day. Three of these a week. That's eleven five at least. Get up here, Vicky. Up here. Up here. Up here. Still got him. Yeah, he's wrapped he ain't up going now. Nowhere. He's, he's right not going he's anywhere, Vicky. Want me to hurt him? Harpoon him now. Go. Stick him. Hold your hand. Go. You know what that means. Time Hold to this. Bring out the bag stick, Hold boy. This. <laughs> Hold this. You tickle them, Vicky. Huh? You tickle them. Cut him in the yeah. throat. <laughs> Here. Hit him. Don't hit him in the hard plate. Hit him right behind the head. Vicky, don't move. Come here. Come to me. Yeah. Hit him right there. Yeah, yeah, I know. Behind, right yeah, behind, behind the, the head. Behind the school. Right there. Holy right there. moly. Right there. Ready? Yeah. Underwater. Let's go. There it is. Oh. 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 Got him that time. Oh my god! Woo! That is a big one. Now we gotta roll this thing in the boat. I don't know how that. I just don't want to lose him. We don't have him with nothing. He's just wrapped up. Dude, you have him with the rope. Hold on, watch out. Grab this rope right here. One, ready? Three. All right. Hold on. Three, one, two. two. One. Now grab that leg and roll him. Vicky. Yeah. Did you ever think we'd catch one this big no. on a mutton snapper head? I did not. Have you ever seen anybody catch one on a mutton snapper head? I, never in my life have I ever seen a gator caught on a mutton snapper head. Let's catch them all. What was your first thoughts when you seen a mutton head? No, you're I talking to my camera. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I said we're going to do this Blue Gabe style. Let's do it right hey. now, boy. Come on. You've seen the boys catch Goliath grouper and those little, you know, those are like juvenile things. We just did it the real way. We caught a mullet. Then we caught a mutton, and now we just caught an 11-foot giant alligator that Vicky manhandled. It got ugly. We broke our main line. Luckily, I had him on the snatch hook. We got him in the boat. He's dead. He's done. Tagged. It's a neat day. It's hot. It's early. Thank you. This is awesome. <laughs> so cool. Anyhow, y'all, alligators are reptiles, and when they're dead, their nerves keep kicking. They keep moving. You want to think he's alive, he's not. He's had two bullets to the head, he's done, he's toast, but he's a reptile. He's going to continue moving for a little while. Hopefully not bite us. He ain't going to bite us. We got tape. For those of y'all that follow my Instagram and watch me put the 12-footer in the boat yesterday, fully alive like a dummy, he could have bit me. This one can't. We got tape on his mouth. So he's done. Vicky got her a giant gator. Colton helped driving. 
We got two fabulous, like, did you ever think we'd have a camera guy like catch him no, off? Two point two million, two point four million subs, and he's out here filming for us. I can't afford a cameraman like that. I know. <laughs> Getting big. So hey, that was it. What That's all we to, got for this oh, episode of the food, food chain. chain fish challenge. I food hope y'all enjoyed it. That's the end of the food chain right there, dude. Doesn't I will though. Yeah. I will show you some bonus footage when we get him out and lay him on a tape and show you how long he is. But right now it's getting dark. We're gonna head back to the truck. We got him tagged. A mullet, a mutton, and an 11 foot alligator. All on the same rod, except for the mullet we caught in a cast net. But the mutton and the gator on the same rod, same braid, same leader. We done. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for all the positive comments. Like Jake says, we're getting what? We're getting out of shape. Hey. But did I do but did I do what I said I was gonna do? You did. That's a challenge.